Welcome to Sex Education. Today, we will talk about both the male condom and the internal condom, which can be used for preventing unintended pregnancy and for protecting against sexually transmitted diseases, or STDs. We will also talk about dental dams, which protect against STDs during oral sex. For more information about other forms of birth control and more detail about sexually transmitted diseases, please see our other videos. A male condom is a thin, flexible material that covers the penis during sex. It comes in a small, square-shaped package. When the package is removed, it looks like a circle with raised borders and a bubble in the middle. In order to use a condom, first pinch the small bubble in the middle and then place the condom over the erect penis before sex. Roll down the sides until the ring of the condom is around the base of the penis. This way, during ejaculation, semen is released into the tip of the condom instead of into the partner's body. This will protect against pregnancy during vaginal sex because there will be no sperm to meet up with the egg. It will also protect against sexually transmitted diseases, many of which are spread through the semen. After sex, the condom can be carefully taken off and thrown away. The male condom should also be used during anal and oral sex to protect against STDs. An internal condom comes in a similar but slightly bigger package as a male condom. When unwrapped, it looks like a cylinder-shaped bag with one closed end. In order to use it, first squeeze the ring with the closed end between your thumb and pointer finger. Then separate the outside of the vagina and gently place the squeezed end inside. Place your finger into the center of the ring and push the condom as far as you can into the vagina. It should cover the cervix, which is the entrance to the uterus. The outer ring with the open end should be on the outside of the vagina covering it. During sex, guide the penis into the vagina to make sure it goes into the ring instead of to the sides of it. Then, during ejaculation, the semen is released into the inside of the condom rather than into the vagina. This will protect against unintended pregnancy and sexually transmitted diseases by keeping the semen in the condom. After sex, twist the outer ring of the condom before gently removing it from the vagina. The internal condom can be used during anal sex as well by placing it over the penis and slowly guiding it in during sex, or by gently inserting it into the anus. The outer ring should stay on the outside of the body as with vaginal sex. This will also protect against sexually transmitted diseases. Dental dams are rectangular pieces of material placed over the vagina or anus to protect against spread of infection during oral sex. If you don't have a dental dam, you can make your own from a condom. To do this, cut the tip of the condom off, then cut along one side of it to make a rectangle. You can place this rectangle over the vagina or anus to protect yourself. Male condoms, internal condoms, and dental dams should never be used more than once. They also come in different brands and sizes and can be found at pharmacies, grocery stores, and a lot of other stores. You can also get them for free at many clinics or doctor's offices. Because condoms can get old, you should always check the expiration date before using them. When used in the right way, condoms are very effective in preventing pregnancy. Besides not having sex, they are also the only way to protect yourself against STDs. So even if you choose other forms of birth control, it's best to use condoms as well to fully protect yourself. Using condoms shows that you respect your and your partner's body. It's a way of protecting your health and the health of those around you, so you should never be embarrassed about getting them 
or using them. Thank you so much for watching and see our other videos to learn more.